And you don't need that poha. It says sugar spike hota hai. So? It will cause diabetes. I saw it in that reel. How? Eddie, you know that black thing that people wear na, on their arms? It shows something, na? I don't know the details, but kuch hota hai. Let me explain. You see, blood sugar spikes are a very normal part of a body's response to any food. There's nothing to be afraid of. Here's how it works. When you eat any food, your body breaks down the carbohydrates into glucose. Now, glucose is a sugar. It's the main source of energy for your body. When this sugar enters your bloodstream is when you get a blood sugar spike. And that's what that little black thingy captures. Oh, so why is everyone going crazy about look how much this poha spiked my blood sugar? Tell me what happens when you eat a big plate of poha for breakfast. I feel very happy. But then I also feel really sleepy and before I know it, I've missed my deadline. Exactly. You see, your poha, which is just rice flakes, is a simple carb. And simple carbs convert into sugar really rapidly. So, blood sugar spikes. And you know what happens to things that go up really fast, right? They come down even faster, so your blood sugar crashes. And so does your energy. Oh, but then why were you having poha? Hmm, because my poha is not just poha. It's poha plus veggies plus peanuts. The peanuts have protein and fats, which take time to digest plus the veggies have fiber which slows down the release of glucose into the bloodstream so my blood glucose graph after all of these additions would look something like this smooth no sharp rise no sharp fall mm, got it but does that mean i can eat anything as long as my energy levels are fine nope do that for long enough and you risk developing diabetes see i knew it diabetes that's what the reel said but why? Meet insulin. Mm. You see, every time you eat food, your blood sugar rises and your pancreas secretes this hormone called insulin, whose job it is to pull out this blood sugar and put it into your cells. But if you keep having very frequent spikes and crashes like this, then over time, your insulin response can get broken. Which is to say that excess sugar can get left in your bloodstream and that's a really bad thing. And that's also diabetes. Oh, got it. So I can have the poha, but with veggies and peanuts and not every day perhaps. Exactly. And don't have naked carbs like poha, right? Add some protein, add some good fats, add some fiber and by all means also have that treat. Like have that parantha, have that cake and on that day don't even look at that CGM patch, right? Just don't do it too often. Treat it like a treat and then retreat and that's the whole truth. And that's what that little black thingy captures. Should I? Okay, sorry. Was there a cut or should I have just continued? Um, oh, f I looked in the camera. Sorry. <laughs> exactly. You see, your poha, which is just rice, convert into sugar. Ve ah. Do it again. My poha is not your poha.